Dumilang, it's one of Americans. Dumilang. We're currently on a road trip from Wisconsin to Iowa in the United States, but we want to talk about why we decided to get married in South Africa. We just recently got married. Mm -hmm. What was the date? March 20. It's debatable. Oops. <laughs> debatable. Is it March 24th or March 25th? But I think officially it's March 25th. Personally, I feel like okay, you yeah. passed that test. Okay. okay. Uh, but why did we... We both live in America now, so why did we decide to get married in South Africa? Uh, mm -hmm. First reason. I had to be respectful to my culture. So, uh, Lobola, a.k.a. Dowry, uh, is Lobola is a, a, an African tradition or let me just be specific and say it's one a tradition which is the actual marriage in my culture as a Tswana person and so we wanted to be respectful of my culture and have the Lobola which is the African wedding ceremony and um what goes around yeah. the exactly, Lobola ceremony. And it, it fits with American culture too because oftentimes, oftentimes you have the ceremony at the, the hometown of the bride anyway. So in this case, it was South yeah. Africa. So uh, that, that part of it worked. Uh, mm -hmm. So we respected tradition. Second, yeah, we respected both traditions, right? We actually respected both traditions. Yeah. yeah. I guess secondly, we can make we'll make a separate video about this. I think we'll break down the cost and tell you why. But it was actually the same, or maybe even cheaper, to do this whole wedding in South Africa. Believe it or not, uh, factoring in even factoring in travel, factoring in travel and a mini honeymoon, right? And a mini honeymoon. Mini honeymoon. Yeah. So we'll do a separate video on that and and bear the um, share the actual cost of our wedding and compare it to the cost of a wedding in an average cost of a wedding in the United States. And it's factoring in music and food and service and decorations and cakes and things like that. Right. An average wedding in the U.S. is something like thirty something, thirty five or thirty thousand dollars. So we can get it uh, well under that. Mm -hmm. But we'll do that in separate videos. So tradition cost. Sadly, I have a big family, and in my culture, uh, especially in my in my area, I should say, because I'm from a village uh, in South Africa, we don't necessarily send out invitation wedding invitation cards as is done in Western world, where you say. Um, plus one I invited and yeah. people are going to have seating arrangements and uh, it's a I mean typically is what maybe 50 to 200 200 wedding would be huge and 200 is pretty big for the US yeah. it's, it's pretty big and so maybe not that common right I don't know what the average would be we can look it out maybe about 100 120 would be so coming from where I come from, I have a big family, a lot of extended families, and Paul was surprised that every, almost everybody I introduced him to was like, this is my cousin, my other cousin, and in a day you would meet like 50 cousins of mine. I, I just started thinking, why should I even ask anymore? They're all, they're all cousins. They're all cousins, yeah. So it would have been, um, almost impossible to bring everybody to the United States to come to a wedding here uh, as opposed to the Americans I used to keep you know you can keep it intimate right yeah. so we brought you know plus for the Americans it was a great chance for a once-in-a-lifetime trip to South Africa uh, and we brought what, 14 15 16 people along in total maybe mm -hmm. uh, Awesome, you know, like I said, a trip of a lifetime, awesome, awesome experience. I think everyone would say that. Yeah. 
and yeah, the extended family, and I think you touched on it, but people, there's a wedding in South Africa, people just show up, there, there's no invitations, it's just like, mm -hmm. uh, you know, you, you can't, you couldn't invite them all, and... Yeah, particularly in a village, though. Yeah, yeah. A village wedding, yeah. Mm -hmm. Which was very interesting to the Americans because it's, it's definitely something unusual, right? Unheard yeah. of yeah. here. Mm -hmm. So those were the there reasons. All right. Peace out. <laughs>